If you were to make a list of all the questions I've gotten over the past seven years or so here on the channel, somewhere in the neighborhood of 13 to 1500 videos, I've lost count. One of the most common questions would probably be about what watch I happen to be wearing in that particular video. Well, the watch I've been wearing in the last few videos, um, and I've been wearing these watches for a couple of months now, are, the, are from the folks at Winfield Watch Company, and I've got one on right now, and here's a, a different one. And these watches were specifically designed and created um, with uh, outdoor activities, um, high adventure type activities in mind. So I think they're a really good fit for the channel. We're gonna take a look at them coming up next here on Survival on Purpose. Welcome back to Survival on Purpose, your home for trustworthy information and gear reviews related to camping, survival, and general preparedness for regular folks. My name is Brian. Thanks for joining me. And as I said, the folks at Winfield Watches were kind enough to send me a couple of their um, newest design watches. And, and like I also said, these, these watches are specifically designed with um, high adventure type outdoor activities in mind and we're gonna talk about some of the features that make them really well suited for that, and a little bit about the watch company itself, and go into some details and show you what I think is so cool about these particular watches. Right after this word from one of our sponsors, and this video today is sponsored by the folks, again, at Big Daddy Unlimited. I know you've heard me talking about Big Daddy Unlimited over and over and over. You may even be tired of hearing it, but the reason I keep, I keep talking about them is because I really truly believe they are a really good place for you to save some money. Um, I know I save money there every single year. Their membership site, if you're not familiar, and um, if you pay a little bit every month to be a member, unless you get uh, take advantage of near wholesale prices on stuff. And it gives you an opportunity maybe to, to have a, a, a more of a limited, um, limited competition for, for hard to find stuff than you might find in the, in the general public. For example, I checked just as I was making this video, September the 30th, and they had a Smith & Wesson Shield 9mm pistols. They had nine of them in stock, and if you've been looking for pistols lately, you know that 9mm pistols are really hard to find, so, so they have those. And they also had, which is really cool, a pretty good bit of, of the new Ruger 22 Wranglers, which is a single action 22 caliber six shooter, just a good old plinker, and stay tuned, you might see one of those on the channel soon. Um, just, um, just a couple of examples for you of the fact that um, as a member, you're kind of a member of a smaller, I mean, there's a lot of members, don't get me wrong, but you're still a lot less members there than there are in the general public competing, competing for these things. And those, if they're not a member, they don't have the opportunity to even buy them. So you're not competing with millions and millions of people for a very limited, um, limited stock of stuff right now. So anyway, so that being said, the, uh, uh, again, I think Big Daddy Unlimited is a, is a great, great, great place to uh, save money on guns and ammo and knives and outdoor gear and stuff. I'm a member and have been for a while. I pay them my 10 bucks a month. Um, that's what it costs. But if you use the link in the video description below, you can get your first month for just 99 cents. Check it out and see if you think it'll be worth your while. So um, I know it has been worth my while and I, you, you couldn't pry that membership out of my greedy little hands right now. So anyway, um, thanks again to the folks at Big Daddy Unlimited for sponsoring the channel. So um, there's that. Now let's talk about the uh, Winfield watches. And I think what we'll do is I'm just gonna bring you down to the old stump top, show you some close-ups, and talk about what makes these watches so cool and what I like about them. And we'll wrap this thing up because it's just a watch. It shouldn't take a whole lot of time. <laughs> okay, so here's a Winfield watch. This is the MT2 and this is the MT1. And one thing I think is really cool is whichever model you buy, it's going to come in this cool watch roll. And this is a uh, really cool little deal here. So it's a wax canvas watch roll. And I've got some other bands in here that are optional I want to show you. But basically, this thing rolls up. And it rolls this way, I guess. It has a really cool little leather strap on it. It's just really very nice and a little Winfield logo there. So just a pretty cool little, little detail I think is neat. And if you, if you collect watches or you got extra, extra watches, you, you, can, you can store them in here and it's a pretty neat way to do that. So anyway, let's talk about the specs of the watches first and then we'll talk about uh, a couple other things and we'll wrap this up because it shouldn't take a whole lot of time. Okay, I probably worked that little pun to, to pieces. So. Uh, both the watches have the same specs. You can see they have a little bit different look. The MT1 has larger uh, hour hands and it has a little date window right down there between the four and the five at kind of a little offset angle. That's just pretty cool. 
The MT2 does not have a date window, but it does have the 24 hour um, markings inside. So you, if, you're, if you're like me and you have to struggle with military time, you've got that. And it's also got 60 second markings there. Um, this is available in, in, in both the black bezel or the stainless bezel, as is the MT2. So you can get them either way. Um, they come standard with a leather band on it. It's a really nice thick leather band. You also get to choose from uh, one of four different color NATO bands along with it too. So you, you, get, you got two bands basically with it. So anyway, let's talk about the specs of these things and then we'll talk about the band. So first of all, this, the case is made of heat treated 316L stainless steel with a bead blasted finish. So this is a stainless steel case. Um, it's water resistant to 200 meters or 600 uh, 60 feet, which is pretty cool. It's a double gasketed screw down, screw down crown, so um, you don't have to worry about that. You have to unscrew it before you can adjust the time on it. As it was, also, it's got a really cool 120 click unidirectional bezel, so it's like a countdown bezel. So if you want to, um, like for example, if you're looking at the minute hand, you want to set yourself up for a 10 minute timer, you sit that there to 10, and then when the minute hand gets around to zero, to the little red dot, our little red arrow it's been 10 minutes so um and it's, it's really really positive too it's, it, it clicks really good and it's, and it's uh two clicks per minute so that's pretty neat 120 clicks uh, the, the crystal is a domed sapphire with double anti-reflective coating so it is solid I'll tell you i've been wearing this one it worked and like I've said before, I don't really do a whole lot of crazy work, but I've got, I'm, you know, but I am on construction sites and I bang this thing. And every time I've hit it on something, I'm like, oh crap, did I just scratch that thing up? So far, it's, there's no scratches. It's looking really, really good. Uh, let's see. The dial is bead blasted brass with a dark charcoal PVD coating. So no plastic dial in here, no paper, it's brass inside there. Just everything's solid. Um, the other thing that's really cool is the loom that's on the hands on, on the uh, M MT2, it's on the hands, it's on the little dots, it's on it's on the the uh, nine six, you know, all the hour markers and the interior 24 hour markers, and the little uh, your your bezel your bezel index right here. Um, it is extra heavy C3 loom. So I can tell you that if, if I wear this thing all day, and, and when it starts to get dark, even like after it's been dark for several hours, I can still see the hands. Um, they, they, they they hold their brightness pretty well. They're, they're not um, they're not tritium. They're, they are definitely just glow in the dark, but they work pretty well. The movement on this thing is a Ronda 715 Li with a 10-year battery life, and its magnetic resistance is 18.8 OE. If you're a watch person, you probably know what that means. I have no idea. And it's anti-shock at NIHS 91-10 compliant. So there you go. That's whatever that means as well. Uh, these things have a 41 millimeter diameter this way and from lug to lug they are 48.5 millimeters this way and they're uh, they're 13 point uh, actually just 13 millimeters thick with the dome crystal thickness and the uh, lug width where the band goes is 20 millimeters so pretty much a standard 20 millimeter um, band is wide band is going to fit so that's the specs of the watches, which are pretty cool. Um, you know, I, these are quartz movements. I like the fact that they're quartz. Uh, and the reason I spoke with, with um, Mark Miller, who's the uh, designer, creator, and, and, and the, the owner of Winfield Watches. And he, by the way, is a master scuba diver, an avid skier, photographer, and a mountain biker. He's also a veteran who served 10 years with Naval Intelligence stationed both with the Naval Special Warfare and Naval Aviation teams in Iraq. So he's, uh, he's been around the block a time or two and he knows, he knows what he's doing. He actually got, kind of got involved with watches and started uh, rebuilding old Seikos. And, and so he knows all about the inside of these things, which is pretty cool. But I had a conversation with him and w one of the things he told me was that, look, you know, everybody likes automatic watches, but to, to build an automatic watch of this quality is going to be it, it'd be around a thousand bucks or more so he's trying to he's trying to introduce his brand with some um with some really solid watches that are that are a lot more affordable than that so the price on these is 399 it's about 400 bucks which is certainly not a cheap budget watch but it's in my opinion it's a watch that's going to last a long long time uh 10 year battery and probably the watch itself is probably really would last you your entire life if you get the battery changed so they're just really built like a tank and they look really good so um 
I, I think that's, you know, if you price watches, you know that watches can get crazy expensive. And, and I think that's a, a reasonably fair price for a watch of this quality. Now, I want to talk real quickly about the bands and we'll wrap this up because I want to at least have some sort of information on here besides just a little, a little review. So, you notice I said they come with the one leather band and your choice of the um, NATO bands. And then you got, we've got the, like the silver gray, we got the green, got like a, a, a khaki, maybe this khaki is, I'm not sure. Maybe this is OD. And then we've got the gray with the um, kind of a khaki, khaki trim on it, which I think is pretty cool. And if you're not familiar with, with the, the benefits of a NATO band, just go ahead and show you. So for example, this one here, a standard watch band. If you're wearing this and this is gonna be the weak point right here, you know, this little this little hinge, and this happens to break, then it's gonna be as if this were apart and the watch can just fall off. If you'll notice on the NATO band, the watch itself, the band itself, goes completely through the watch like so. So even if, if, if one of these breaks, is still going to be connected to the other side. So, for example, it, you know, just it would just, it would be flopping around, but it'd still be connected. So you would have your watch. You wouldn't lose your watch. That's the benefit of a NATO band. And if you notice, I'll put this one on for you, and it's going to be upside down. But let me just, it's going to be off frame for a minute too, because I can't do it without rubbing, resting it on my leg or something. But um, I have a reasonably small wrist. And so I, um, I just, this thing's pretty long. I just take it and instead of cutting it off, I just bend it up in there like that. And it seems to work pretty well. And it looks like one of the pictures on the website do the same thing. So you could cut it off if you want to and just, just um, you know, singe it with, with a lighter or whatever, but it works pretty well for me. Um, so that's the Winfield watches. Now, let me just tell you real quickly. Um, I know people are gonna ask me which one I like the best. And I'm having a real, real, real hard time deciding that because I like the way this one looks. I like the, uh, I like the 24 hour time inside there. I think it looks good. Um, but I really like the date on this one. Um, I've been wearing this one more because I, I wanted to leave these other bands <laughs> kind of new for the video, but I'm probably gonna change this band out to maybe the green one and start wearing this one more. Cause I like the date. It's just easy. I use, you know, I, for me, that, that that date comes in handy, so I, I don't have to remember what the day it is, because sometimes they all run together. But they're both really, really cool. And so that'd be your choice. You can actually get this one with the silver bezel, which might be pretty cool, too. So um, they have, again, either one's available with either color, color bezel. So that's it. Um, that's the uh, Winfield watches. I think they're pretty cool, and they're definitely rock solid. Chug Norris' first job was a paper boy. There were no survivors. Okay, well that was a hopefully reasonably coherent look at uh, the MT1 and MT2 Mission Series watches from the folks at Winfield Watch Company. And like I said, these are, um, they're not super low budget watches. They're about 400 bucks a piece, but they are extremely well made. I like the fact they are made uh, with outdoor type, rugged outdoor adventures in mind and they're not just created by a group of business people who decided they were gonna make some watches. Because if you look around, everybody's making watches now. Um, these things were, 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 were hand designed and created by, by somebody who, who walks the walk and talks the talk. And I mean, not only a naval officer, but also just an outdoor adventure guy himself. And they're really, really rock solid. And, and one thing that I, when I did this thing, I think I did it on, on Facebook, I did a little thing on Facebook or Instagram. And a couple of people commented, you know, if it's going to be for survival, it's going to have to be an automatic. But well, look, everything doesn't have to be about survival, okay? As a matter of fact, most of us will never, ever, ever be in a survival situation our entire life. But we are going to be, live, be in a day-to-day -day situation. We're going to go camping and maybe skiing and hiking or mountain climbing or rock climbing or, or swimming or diving or whatever. And... We need a watch that's going to stand up to those those, those type of abuses and those those type of challenges. And so far, the Winfield Watch Company is doing really well for me. And they've the Winfield Watch is doing really well for me. And they've got a couple of other people who are like crazy ice climbers and rock climbers and stuff that are world class athletes that that also um, have spoken really well of these. So bottom line, if you're looking for a really well made, solid 
good looking um, watch that will, like, like the old fashioned Timex, will take a licking and keep on ticking. Uh, and Timex might even sue me for saying that, but you know, you know what I'm talking about. They're just a really, really solid watch, really well made, and they look pretty good too. Um, you know, and again, 10 year battery life. I, I just think that is rock solid. So, you might want to check out the uh, Winfield Watch Company. I'll put a link in the video description below. Um, once again, thanks to the folks at Winfield Watch for sending me these too, so I could check them out and test them and also so I could show them to you. And as always, thank you for watching Survival on Purpose. I put out a brand new video every Friday and Saturday and sometimes random videos throughout the week. If you want to make sure you don't miss a single one, I invite you to go to survivalonpurpose.com forward slash subscribe. Sign up for my weekly email newsletter. Every week I'll send you an email with any news, offers, or deals I think you might be interested in and a little, uh, links to previous videos. And I'm also doing every week a... Um, kind of like a blast from the past video of one of my older videos so you can laugh at my hair or, or whatever you want to laugh at so anyway um, I really sincerely appreciate the support once again my name is Brian you're watching survival on purpose remember survival is not an accident so be prepared I'll see you next time